a very good evening to everyone in this today's session we will understand the various concepts of private equity as well as the venture capital transaction aapko dekhne mein bahut difficult words lag rahe honge all these concepts are very 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 easy if you want to make your career as the in house counsel or if you join a law firm every day day to day life you are very much required to comply the requirements with respect to this only that is why private equity as well as the venture capital transactions are most important now a days but no problem at all in this today's class we will understand the concept in the easy manner let me share the screen with everyone first of all okay just a second see this in this today's class we will understand the concept of right issue yes we will understand the concept of esops thereafter preferential allotment preferential allotment thereafter private placement yes thereafter bonus shares and yes the last one is thereafter the sweat equity shares all these concepts we will learn in this today's class but yes let me tell you one thing beta if you understand all these concepts in detail no one can stop you to get a job in big law firms or as well as to become the in house counsel no one can stop you because as a corporate lawyer this field is very very attractive for everyone all right let's start today's agenda with right issue right issues for example beta this is reliance no problem sir reliance industries limited no problem now for an example beta this reliance company has let's say 100 shareholders this reliance company has 100 shareholders no problem as such now let's say beta the authorized share capital the authorized share capital of the company is for an example 10 lakh so what is the meaning of authorized share capital dekho beta authorized share capital means a maximum amount a company can take from the shareholders by issuing the shares okay let's say beta the paid up capital paid up capital of the reliance is 6 lakhs so what is the what do you understand by the term paid up capital now dhyan se samajhna paid up capital means the amount deposited by the shareholders or the amount given by the shareholders to the company so this is paid up share capital and this is the maximum amount a company can take from the shareholder no problem as such as of now now understand this there is a problem now this reliance industries limited are in the requirements of fund this company is in the requirements of funds for an example beta company is in the requirements of rupees 4 lakhs company is in the requirements of 4 lakhs so my question to everyone is very simple dhyan se samajh na question is very 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 simple let me give you my house example for example there are four members in my house if i need money will i ask the outsider person ki sir please give me the money or i will ask my family members first of all please do let me know the answer in the chat box very nice priyanka if i am in the requirements of fund i will ask my family members first of all Okay, sir please give me money i am in the requirements of funds 
that is the important point. That is the important point. Sir, this Reliance Industries Limited will ask the existing shareholders, hey, sir, please give us money in return. I will give you the shares bid up. Yes, please, sir. This Reliance Industries will ask 100 shareholders that, sir, please give us the money in return. I will issue you the shares. It means, sir, that is known as right issue. Yes, that is known as right issue. When Reliance Industries Limited is asking the existing members, he sir, please give me the money. I will issue the shares in return. This is known as right issue. Understood, sir. So for an example, beta, this Reliance Industries Limited is in the requirements of 4 lakh rupees as of now. And now this Reliance Industries Limited is asking 100 shareholders, hey, sir, please give me the money. I will issue the shares. So, sir, what are the various requirements we have to comply in this case? Agar aap ek bhot badi law firm join karte ho, Khetan, Link Legal, Cam, Sam, etc. And et then there is a different department that is known as private equity department. In that department, you have to comply with the various procedural requirement as well as the Ministry of Corporate Affairs requirement. Aapko ye requirement karni padegi. But let me tell you with the easy example that how this process will go on. Let me tell you this. First of all, beta, company has authorized share capital of 10 lakh. As of now, the company has paid up capital of 6 lakh. Now the company is in the requirements of 4 lakh rupees. Do let me know the answer in the chat box whether there is the requirement that the company ko apni ye authorized share capital increase. Karni pade. Is there any requirement that company should increase the authorized share capital? Very nice, Prithika, Hirsch. Everyone, no, sir. We can take 10 lakh rupees. And as of now, we have taken 6 lakh rupees. So, yes, sir. We can take 4 lakh rupees as of now. No problem as such. Understood. Now, what will be the procedure, sir? We have understood that there is no requirement. There is no requirement to increase the authorized share capital. Yes, there is no requirement as such. But sir, for an example, let me give you the another example. For example, sir, the authorized share is 10 lakh. The company's paid up share capital is, let's say, beta, 7 lakh. Now the company is in the requirements of 4 lakh rupees. Please do let me know whether there is a requirement to increase the authorized share capital. Yes or no? Very nice. Chinmay, Hirsch, Priyanka, Vijay, Harucha, Prabhat. Very nice. Sir, we have to increase by 1 lakh. Yes. In that case, we have to increase by 1 lakh. Now, please try to understand the procedure. For example, if there is no requirement to increase the authorized share capital, aap step two mein ja sakte ho. you can go with step two. But if there is the requirement to increase the authorized share capital, aapko ek extraordinary general meeting conduct karwani padegi. We have to call extraordinary general meeting. So what is this extraordinary general meeting? Beta, this is a meeting of shareholders. This is a meeting of shareholders. Okay. Now, this shareholders will pass the ordinary resolution. So ordinary resolutions means, for example, there are 100 shareholders. Then yes, consent of 51 shareholders is mandatory to increase the authorized share capital by 1 lakh rupees. That is the concept of ordinary resolution. Very nice. Simple majority. 
नाउ ध्यान से समझना तो सर फॉर एग्जाम्पल ऑर्डनरी रेजोल्यूशन हैज बीन पास नाउ वी हैव टू फाइल वन फॉर्म विद द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ कॉर्पोरेट अफेयर्स एंड द नेम ऑफ द फॉर्म इज एस एच सेवन मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट the name of the form is sh7 to increase the authorized share capital okay sir no problem s sir so we will file form ss7 before the ministry of corporate affairs if there is the requirement to increase the authorized share capital while issuing the bonus or while issuing the right issue understood sir no problem s such now sir this is most important concept step number 2 in step number 2 board of directors will conduct their meeting board of directors will conduct their meeting and in this meeting beta letter of offer yes letter of offer will be finalize sir ye letter of offer kya hota hai let me tell you this letter of offer is a document which will be given to the shareholders by the company ye ek aisa document hota hai beta jo company dwara kisko diya jayega shareholders ko so this is known as letter of offer so board of directors meetings will be conducted and in this meeting letter of offer will be finalize now the step number 3 this letter of offer will be given to the shareholders so dispatch of letter of offer yes dispatch of letter of offer this letter of offer will be dispatched to the existing shareholders by the company and i may aapko ek baat batau minimum 15 days will be given to the shareholders ki sir aap decide kar lo whether you want to give us the cash or not 15 days minimum will be given to the shareholders by the company to decide ki sir aap mujhe paisa dena chahte ho ya nahi dena chahte and the maximum will be 30 days understood sir so 15 minimum maximum 30 days will be given by the company to the shareholders to decide ki sir kya aap paisa dena chahte ho ya nahi dena chahte step number 4 the shareholders will deposit the money let's say they will give the money to the company ki sir yes we want to give the money to the company no problem as such thereafter beta step number 5 shares will be allotted to them shares will be allotted to them and later on beta step number 6 whenever you allot the shares one form will be one form will be filed before the ministry of corporate affairs and the name of the form is pas 3 yes pas 3 will be filed before the ministry of corporate affairs very nice very nice pas 3 will be filed before the ministry of corporate affairs whenever you allot the shares to anyone doesn't matter at all that's the concept of right issue Understood, sir. Understood. If you have the doubt in this right issue concept, you are very much allowed to ask by raising your hand. Yes, anyone? Isha, Isha, you are allowed. Let me unmute you yourself. Just a second. Make a host. Just a second, Isha. Let me unmute you. You are allowed to unmute, Isha. Sir, uh, yes, sir, sir, I I got confused in these two forms, SS7 and PS3. SS7 is better when you increase the authorized share capital. Okay. 
बट वेन एवर यू अलॉट हाँ जी बेटा आप बोलिए पहले आप बोलिए फिर बता सी वेन एवर यू इंक्रीज दी ऑथोराइज ऑथोराइज शेयर कैपिटल यू हैव टू फाइल एस एस सेवन फोर ओके बट वेन एवर यू अलॉट द शेयर एक्चुअली अलॉट द शेयर यू हैव टू फाइल पैस थ्री फॉर्म इन दैट केस यस बेटा ओके सर सो एस एक्स सेवन इज इन केस ऑफ इंक्रीजिंग द शेयर कैपिटल एंड पी ए एस थ्री इज इन शेयर अलॉटमेंट राइट करेक्ट राइट एंड सर इन केस टू इंक्रीज अथोराइज शेयर कैपिटल आपने कौन सी मीटिंग बताई थी ऑर्डनरी जनरल मीटिंग बेटा ओके ठीक है ओके एंड वी विल पास ऑर्डनरी रेजोल्यूशन यस वी विल फाइल द ऑर्डनरी रेजोल्यूशन ओके ओके थैंक यू सर यस हर्ष यू आर अलाउड टू अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ गुड इवनिंग सर वेरी गुड इवनिंग सर माय क्वेश्चन इज अ बिट सिंपल दैट द कांसेप्ट ऑफ राइट इशू इज जस्ट टू इंक्रीज द ऑथराइज्ड शेयर कैपिटल राइट इंक्रीज द पेड अप शेयर कैपिटल बेटा increase the paid up share capital and the steps you gave we have to ful fulfill those yes that's the whole process you have to comply and for um, increasing the authorized paid up share capital we have Auth to authorize uh, you authorize see beta authorize uh, share capital yes authorized share capital is different thing beta and paid up capital is different thing. let me give yeah, you the I, example i i, I got him For example, no, sir, I, a, I understood. Okay, I this is a let. The total storage okay, okay, is let the eight GB. Okay, so this eight GB yes. is the authorized share capital. Okay, okay. let I have filled the photos in this form up to two GB. So this two GB is the paid up. Paid up share capital. Understood, sir. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, let me check the name of the students. Dhruv, you are allowed to unmute yourself. Uh, good evening, sir. So, Very so good step evening. number six, so uh, step number four. Sorry, you said that shareholders will provide the money to the company. So, what happens in the case when the right issue option is given to the company uh, shareholders and they do not provide the money within the set time period of fifteen days or thirty? So, the offer will be declined, beta. <laughs> okay. Yes, in that case, the offer will be declined. Yes. Any other doubt to anyone? Let me check the. You are very much allowed to raise your hand if you have the doubts. No doubts. So right issue is completed. Let me check the Pranka. Yeah, Pranka is saying, sir, both the form has to be filed with register of company. Beta, if there is a case ki jahan par aapki authorized share capital is increasing, we have to file SS seven as well as PAS three. But if your authorized share capital is not increasing, then you just only have to pass pass three form beta in that case. अरे इतने सारे बच्चों ने end this कर लिया. Okay, let me see this one by one. Muskan, you are allowed to unmute yourself, beta. Uh, sir, what happened after the offer gets? Uh, I mean, I forgot my question. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you may ask me later. Okay, if you remember. Uh, no, yes. the person, yeah. sir, that he asked that uh, if he failed to pay within the set period of fifteen or thirty days, then what happened? The shares will be better. This offer will be declined then. हम उससे पूछेंगे नहीं फिर बात. Okay, so there's no. देखो सही. I asked my dad. Dad, please give me the money within fifteen days. Dad, ne koi jawab hi nahi diya. Ab pandha din ke baad to main kisi aur se hi maangu ho na. Iska matlab deemed rejection hai. Yes or no? Okay, sir. Okay. So, sir, the person. I have asked you. 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 I have Okay, so okay. Done. Okay, very nice. Yes. Yes, Sanchit, you are allowed to unmute yourself.
गुड इवनिंग सर वेरी गुड इवनिंग सचित प्लीज गो हेड सर सो माय क्वेश्चन इज इन द राइट्स इशू इशू केस सपोज देयर इज अ पार्शियल एक्सेप्टेंस एंड पार्शियल डिक्लाइन ऑफ द राइट इशू शेयर्स सो द रिमेनिंग शेयर्स विल बी ऑफर्ड टू द एग्जिस्टिंग शेयर होल्डर्स और अ न्यू और विल दे बी ऑफर्ड टू द लाइक टू द आईपी और और प्राइवेट प्लेसमेंट ओके दैट्स द बिट अनदर कांसेप्ट आई विल टीच दिस कांसेप्ट विद इन 5 टू 10 मिनट्स ओके Okay, very nice. Sir. Nice question. Apart from this, no question. No, sir. Very nice, Achit. Yes, Aryaman, you are allowed to unmute yourself now. Yes, sir. I want to ask why past three form is called past three. Is there a full form or something like? Past three form. Yes, brother. There is a full form. There is a full form of yes, every sir, what form. Yes, sir. What is that? Just writing this. Uh, so, okay? can you mention? Yes, brother. Yes, yes, yes. No need to worry. Okay. All right, sir. Understood. Is there any other question to everyone, sir? What is the meaning of SS seven, sir? What is the meaning of past three? Just a second, but I will let you know everything. Everything. You don't need to worry about the same. Right issue concept is clear to everyone. Yes or no? मुझे आप chat box में बता सकते हो. The concept of right issue is it clear to everyone? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Very nice, Chin Me. Everyone is saying yes. See, that is the most important points, beta. In practical life, you have to comply with the various requirements. You have to comply with the various requirements. Understood, sir. So, sir, students are saying, so what is pass three? And very nice, Ashna. Very nice. Pass P A S. There is a chapter in the Companies Act, and the name of the chapter is. uh yes arshna just a second let me check here very nice prospectus and allotment of securities prospectus and allotment of securities okay this is pas that is the full form of beta pas pas 3 we have to file whenever we allot the shares to anyone under share So sir, let me give you one question. Please do let me know the answer in the chat box. For an example, beta, this is Reliance Industries. The authorized share capital is ten lakh rupees, and the paid-up share capital is let's say, beta, just a second. Paid-up share capital is ten lakh rupees. Now the company is in the requirements of two lakh rupees. whether we have increased the authorized share capital in that case you are very much allowed to give me the answer in the chat box very nice sudanshu priyanka prithika harucha muskan so proud of you gurpreet everyone is saying yes sir we have to alter the we have to increase the authorized share capital in that case by 2 lakh rupees and sir we will conduct the extraordinary general meeting and we will pass the ordinary resolution in that case very nice isha thereafter sir we will file sh7 also very nice so proud of you one student is writing a doubt in the chat box what happens if the shareholders over subscribe to the right issue offer do we have to follow the same procedure data there is no over subscription in the case of the right issue aapka right dekho dhyan se samjho if i am asking 2000 rupees from my father my father will not give me 5000 rupees le beta le le that's not the concept okay right that's the concept of beta right issue now let's begin the next concept this is esop still let me tell you the next concept for the more got it thank you very nice achit okay for an example beta let's try to understand the concept of now bonus shares so what is bonus shares dhyan se samajhna bada maza aayega for example beta this is reliance industries limited okay sir no problem as such now reliance industries limited has 100 shareholders okay sir no problem at all the authorized share capital of the company is 
let's say the authorized share capital is 10 lakh rupees and the paid up capital is let's say better to 8 lakh rupees no problem as such the company has a profit of rupees beta kitna profit hai inka 2 crore rupees faltu mein pada savings padi hai sir company has a profit of rupees 2 crores ab dhyan se samajh ab bade important samajh i am backing you in class 12 ab chalte hai beta class 12th mein whenever company received the cash आप ये एंट्री मारते थे बेटा बैंक अकाउंट डेबिट टू शेयर एप्लीकेशन यस और नो बेटा फॉर एन एग्जांपल बेटा टेन रुपीस एंड टेन रुपीस देर आफ्टर यू राइट्स शेयर एप्लीकेशन शेयर एप्लीकेशन टू शेयर कैपिटल अगेन टेन रुपीस एंड टेन रुपीस it means beta jo debit hua that is credit also so sir ye 10 rupees aur 10 rupees kat gaya net effect kya hua bank account debit to just a second to beta share capital it means beta whenever company issue the shares bank account will be debit and yes share capital will increase but let me tell you one another concept there is a concept that is known as beta bonus shares in this bonus shares beta company will not ask money from the shareholders no company will not ask money from the shareholders company ke paas bahut sara paisa hai beta see this company has 2 crore rupees they are not in the requirements of funds. They have so much funds. Unke paas bhot paisa hai beta. Bhot paisa. Now, what I will do? I will say, hey, 100 shareholders. Idar out. I am giving you a shares of the company free of cost. Yes. I am giving you the shares of the company free of cost. You don't have to pay me even a single rupees in this case. That's the concept of bonus shares. So, company is issuing the shares, but in return, company is not getting even a single rupees. Why? Because company has so much profit. Company ke paas beta bhoot sara profit hai. So, sir, for an example, beta, normally we do entry of bank account debit to share app share capital but sir in this case share capital will increase yes share capital will increase but bank account will not be debited kyunki hamare paas kuch bhi nahi aaya hai to sir question aata hai what i will write in the debit side main debit side pe kya likhu that's the important point ab dhyan se samjho Sir, I have a profit of 2 crore rupees. Yes or no? Yes, sir. I have a profit of 2 crore rupees. This is the account rule, beta. This is the account rule. Ki profits ko hum kya karte hai? Credit. We credit the amount of profits. Whenever we want to decrease the amount of profit, we debit the profit. Yes or no? Normally, hum profit ko karte beta credit. But yes. Whenever we want to decrease the amount of profit, hum kya kar rete hai? Debit kar rete hai. Uh, for example, beta, I have 2 crore rupees in my gulak. I want to put this 2 crore rupees, mujhe 2 crore rupees yaan se nikalne hai, aur kisi or gulak mein daalne, share capital thi gulak mein daalne hai. So sir, I will make this general entry. What? Profit account debit to share capital that's the basic point of that's the basic point of beta bonus shares in bonus shares we will not get even a single rupees um apni profit ki gullak ko kam kar dete hai and in return we increase the share 
capital. Sir, why? Why company issue the shares free of cost? Why, sir? There is one reason behind this. Before bonus shares, the market price of the share is 100 rupees. And do you know, after bonus shares, the market price of the shares will be around 150 rupees. Jab bhi muft mein cheez milti hai na beta, shareholders bhaag te ki, sir, hume bhi shares chahiye, hume bhi shares chahiye. So, sir, the market price of the shares will increase in that case. That's the basic point that the company issue the shares free of cost whenever the company has accumulated profit. Jab bhi company ke paas profit hota hai, company issue the shares free of cost to increase the market price of the shares. That's the basic concept of beta, bonus shares. So, sir, I have a doubt. If the company is planning to issue the bonus shares, what are the various requirements? I see, kon kon si requirements hoti hai, sir, in that case. Let me tell you this with the example bit. See this. This is Reliance Industries. Let's say the authorized share capital is 10 lakh. No problem as such. Paid up capital is 8 lakh. Company wants to issue the bonus shares of rupees 4 lakhs, let's say. Company has to, in, uh, company wants to issue 4 lakh rupees bonus shares. Now, I have a question for everyone. Whether there is the requirement to increase the authorized share capital in this case? Yes or no? Very nice, Dhruv, Priyanka. Sachit. Archana, so proud of you, Chinmay. Very nice, Pritika. Yes, sir, Adarsh. So we have to increase the share capital, the authorized share capital by 2 lakh rupees. So proud of you, everyone. Dinky. We have to increase the authorized share capital by 2 lakh rupees. And sir, which resolution will be passed in this case? Sir, ordinary resolution. And which form will be filed? Before the Ministry of Corporate Affairs, beta. Very nice, Prinka. SH7 in this case. So proud of you, everyone. SS7 will be filed in this case. Prabhat, so proud of you. Rohan, Rishika. SH7. Understood, sir. Lydia, understood. Now, for example, beta, if company wants to issue the bonus shares and there is no requirement to increase the authorized share, capital for an example so first thing is that beta we have to conduct the extraordinary general meeting i make extraordinary general meeting karayenge. okay and this extraordinary general meeting we will pass the ordinary resolution understood sir no problem as such thereafter beta you will check aap ek Condition check karoge. Is there any default in the principal amount or the interest amount in ya to fixed deposits ya to debentures beta. Ya to fixed deposits ya to debentures. You will check ki sir, is there any default committed by the company in payment of the principal amount or the interest amount. Ya to fixed deposits ka jo company ne liye hai, ya to debentures ka. If there is a default, agar default hai, your company cannot, your company cannot issue the bonus shares in that case. Company cannot issue the bonus shares in that case. The third thing that you will check no default in statutory payments, statutory payments towards the employer, towards employees. It means, beta, company should not make the default in payment of 
employee provident fund gratuity employee state insurance jo bhi employee se related kanun hai company should not default in this case agar kiye honge beta company cannot issue the bonus shares in that case now let me give you the question and the question is in front of you for an example sir company has made the default company ne default kiya hai in payment of dividend payment of dividend to equity shareholders whether the company is eligible to issue the bonus shares in this case please do let me know the answer in the chat box samiksha is saying no okay pritika is saying yes rishika is saying yes dhruv is saying i think yes aditi is saying no so some are saying no some are saying yes but the answer is lidya is saying no i guess just a second lidya you said no just a second bro prabhat said no okay lidya said yes so the answer is allowed yes no problem as such are sir i have written that there is no default in the principal amount or the interest amount in the fixed deposits ya to debentures kya maine ye likha hai ki company should not default in payment of dividend to the equity shareholders nahi sir i have not written the same so agar maine nahi likha it means ye allowed hai if the company has made the default in the payment of dividend then sir no problem as such company can issue the bonus shares in this case understood sir no problem as such sir who ensures that there is no default is there a statutory authority chinmay saying this beta the company secretary of the company or you as the in house counsel will ensure this jab aap bade ho ke beta company join karoge na you have to ensure all these things if you have the doubt as of now because some student says the hand you are very much allowed to ask me one by one yes sanchit sachit you are allowed to unmute yourself no doubt i guess sachit okay gurpreet you are allowed to unmute gurpreet you are allowed to unmute yes beta sir सर इन दिस सर जैसे कंपनी डिविडेंड अगर डिक्लेयर कर दिया कंपनी ने वो इशू कर दिया है ना डिक्लेयर किया वो डिविडेंड अगर इशू नहीं करती तो सर वो तो डिफॉल्ट माना जाता है ना अरे इफ देयर इज अ डिफॉल्ट देयर इज नो प्रॉब्लम यू कैन इशू द बोनस शेयर स्टिल ओके सर सर ये दिस वाज ओनली द डाउट कि अगर डिक्लेयर करके इशू नहीं किया तो वो डिफॉल्ट होगा डिफॉल्ट होगा बट स्टिल यू कैन इशू द बोनस शेयर्स ओके सर ओके uh let me see the another student doubt archana please go ahead beta yes so good evening very good evening yes sir bolo uh so so preference uh, shares ko bhi you have to pay no compulsorily annually at the rate yes. uh, prescribed so if they default in paying the preference shares uh, can they issue bonds yes allowed acha <laughs> preference also is okay okay ye loophole hai chhota sa isme na ha okay yes okay, okay sir thank allowed, you you are allowed to unmute yourself sir sir you sir you told us the first point that extraordinary general meeting will hmm. be conducted it will be conducted in case of in case of uh, uh, share capital right yes and not taken only If, in case of in case of share capital no beta to issue the bonus shares also we have to pass the ordinary resolution beta to in, to issue the bonus shares also we have to pass the ordinary resolution that is why we will conduct the extraordinary general meeting yes understood sir no sir aapne first wale case pe right issue mein bataya tha ki general meeting kabhi conduct karenge agar increase karni hai share right उस केस में बोनस इशू में भी बेटा उस केस में हमें रिक्वायरमेंट नहीं है राइट right इशू के लिए अरे आपसे ध्यान से समझना इफ आई वांट टू टेक मनी फ्रॉम माय फादर पहले मैं पापा से पूछूंगा पापा पापा क्या मैं आपसे पैसे ले लूं 
ऐसा पूछूंगा क्या नहीं ना नो सो इन द केस ऑफ राइट इशू आप डायरेक्टली पापा के पास चले जाओ <laughs> समझ रहे हो दैट्स व्हाई कॉलिंग द एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डिनरी जनरल मीटिंग इज नॉट रिक्वायर्ड टू इशू द राइट इशू अगर आप राइट इशू करते हो तो बट टू इशू द बोनस शेयर्स बेटा एक्स्ट्रा ऑर्डिनरी जनरल मीटिंग विल बी कंडक्टेड कि पापा मैं आपको ये कार ना फ्री में देना चाहता हूं आप लेना चाहते हो या नहीं सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल शेयर होल्डर्स विल कंसेंट कि हम लेना चाहते हैं या नहीं यस और नो ओके सर सो मींस इसमें लाइक दोनों ही केस में हम लोग को करनी पड़ेगी मीटिंग बोनस इशू में बोनस इशू में वी हैव टू इट इज मैंडेटरी ओके सर ओके बेटा वेरी नाइस यस प्रियंका यू आर अलाउड टू म्यूट so yes, uh, there is no need of uh, there is no need to declare dividend in case of uh, in case of equity shareholders right but See. agar hmm. uh, preference shares holders ko to wo percentage aur unka fix hota hai right fix hota hai so pay, unko declare karna to mandatory hota hai na for example so if i have declared, declared and still there is a default okay ha huh. still you can issue the bonus shares <laughs> अच्छा देयर नो नीड टू क्लियर द डिफॉल्ट ऑफ प्रेफरेंस शेयर्स बिफोर डिक्लेयरिंग बोनस शेयर्स बोनस शेयर्स यस इन केस ऑफ ओनली प्रेफरेंस शेयर इन अदर केस यू कैन नॉट डिक्लेयर बोनस शेयर्स करेक्ट यू कैन नॉट इशू बोनस शेयर्स वेरी नाइस थैंक यू सो मच ये छोटा सा लूपहोल है जो छुपा हुआ है दैट इज द लूपहोल ओके सर तो अमेंडमेंट क्यों नहीं आता है इसके रिगार्डिंग हां जी अमेंडमेंट क्यों नहीं आता नहीं नहीं आ रहा बेटा जब आएगा तब हम भी नहीं करेंगे अभी तो हम करते हैं ओके यस एनी डाउट टू एनीवन नाउ आई गेस नो सो सर लेट मी टेल यू द प्रोसीजर नाउ बेटा अब रटने की जरूरत ही नहीं है अब आप समझ चुके हो नाउ यू आर कैपेबल टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस फॉर एग्जांपल बेटा इफ कंपनी वांट्स टू इशू द बोनस शेयर लेट से दिस इज केस नंबर वन एंड केस नंबर टू case number 1 company is in the requirement to increase the authorized share capital let's say so company will conduct the extraordinary general meeting in this extraordinary general meeting company will pass two ordinary resolution two ordinary resolution one is to increase one is to increase the authorized share capital and second one is to issue the bonus shares okay now this EGM will be conducted thereafter. Bye bye. We have to file one form. First form is SH, SH seven. Thereafter, beta, the company will allot the shares to the equity shareholders as the case may be. Thereafter, we have to file. We have to file pass three form in that case. So two forms we have to file before the Ministry of Corporate Affairs. and that is known as beta that is known as uh, one is ss7 and another one is pass 3 very very nice chinmay is saying sir bonus shares are also issued to the existing shareholders only yes beta bonus shares to existing walon ko hi do dete ho aap diwali ka bonus kisi stranger ko to nahi dete na aap apne ghar walon ko hi dete ho jisko aap jante ho <laughs> okay understood sir so the concept of bonus shares is clear to everyone now if you still have the doubt in the concept of one is right issue the another one is the bonus shares you are allowed to ask i hope kisi ka koi bhi doubt nahi bacha hai okay now let's move on to the next concept and the name of the concept is esops employee stock option plan employee stock option plan prabhat you don't have any doubt prithika i was expecting some questions from you chalo employee stock option plan sir let me give you the example this is again beta reliance industries no problem as such Reliance Industries Limited. This is let's say Archana. Okay. Archana is joining the 
Reliance Industries Limited. Ashna is joining the Reliance Industries Limited as the compliance officer. Let's say, अच्छे दिन आने वाले हैं अशना के. So Ashna is joining the Reliance Company as compliance officer. No problem, sir. Now, Reliance Industry is saying one thing. Reliance Industry is saying, Ashna, madam. See. If you work with us for next five years, if you work with us for next five years, you will get the right after five years to purchase the shares of the Reliance. To purchase the shares of the Reliance. Let's say better today is twelfth of September two thousand twenty-one. This Ashna Madam is joining the Reliance Industries Limited as the compliance officer today. Now Reliance Industries Limited सपने दिखा रही है Ashna Madam को कि Ashna Madam, if you work with us for next five years, you have the right to purchase the shares of the Reliance at The price of rupees, let's say, beta, let's say two thousand rupees only. One share, rupees two thousand only. Up, ध्यान से समझ दें. Ashna madam is dreaming. Yes, sir. I am expecting that after five years, the shares of the Reliance will be, let's say, five thousand rupees. Yes. अर्चना मैडम इज सेइंग कि सर एज पर माय कैलकुलेशन द शेयर्स ऑफ द रिलायंस आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स विल बी फाइव थाउजेंड रुपीज बट टू परचेज द शेयर्स ऑफ द रिलायंस अर्चना मैडम हैज ओनली गिव हैज ओनली हैज ओनली हैव टू गिव रुपीज टू थाउजेंड ओनली अर्चना मैडम को सिर्फ टू थाउजेंड रुपीज ही देने पड़ेंगे नॉट रुपीज फाइव थाउजेंड आफ्टर दी फाइव Yes, that's the concept of beta. Esops. Esops means the employee is getting the right. Employee is getting the right to purchase the shares of the company. To purchase the shares of the company in future. In future, at predetermined price. It means beta price will be determined now. Price to abhi hi decide ho jayega beta. But yes, you will get the right to purchase the share after five years. You will get the right to purchase the shares after five years. That is the important point. Now, let me tell you this beta. Just a second. Sir, first of all, beta, this is the most important concept. After five years of working, Miss Ashna will get the shares of the Reliance at rupees two thousand. And yes, the market price of the shares is rupees five thousand only. But sir, I have another concept. For example, beta, the share value of the Reliance is rupees thousand only. After five years, after five years, the shares of the Reliance is value of rupees thousand only. आपको क्या लगता है? Whether Ashna Madam will buy the shares of the Reliance at rupees two thousand from the company? Yes or no? Very nice, Chinme, Sachit, Akankrita, Dinky, and very nice, Prabhat. No, sir. So, sir, that's the important point. अर्चना मैडम के पास एक राइट right है अर्चना मैडम हैज द राइट नॉट द ऑब्लिगेशन टू परचेज द शेयर्स ऑफ द रिलायंस आफ्टर द पीरियड ऑफ फाइव इयर्स दैट इज द इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट बेटा नाउ लेट मी सी दिस चैट बॉक्स सुनील यादव सर इज से सर सेक्शन सिक्सटी थ्री थ्री में लिखा है बोनस शेयर्स Shall not issue in lieu of dividend. बेटा यही होता है जब आप रट्टा मारते हो तो अब ध्यान से समझना ये वाला कॉन्सेप्ट 
यस आई अग्री सेक्शन सिक्सटी थ्री थ्री में लिखा है दैट नो बोनस शेयर्स नो बोनस शेयर्स इन लियो ऑफ डिविडेंट लिखा है ओके okay, लिखा है बिल्कुल ठीक लिखा है बट बेटा रट्टा नहीं लगाते रट्टा नहीं लगाना वट आई वॉज चिटी ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड ध्यान से समझना फॉर एग्जाम्पल द कंपनी हैज डिक्लेयर डिविडेंट ऑन द इक्विटी शेयर्स ओके बट द कंपनी फेल्ड कंपनी फेल टू गिव द डिविडेंट टू द इक्विटी शेयर फेल्ड अब ध्यान से समझना इफ कंपनी से बेटा भूल जाओ अपना डिविडेंट भूल जाओ अपना डिविडेंट इंस्टेड ऑफ डिविडेंट आई एम गिविंग यू द बोनस शेयर दिस इज नॉट अलाउड बट इफ कंपनी इज सेम बेटा मैं आपको बोनस शेयर भी दे दूंगी मैं आपको डिविडेंट भी दे दूंगी दिस इज अलाउड दैट इज द लूप होल सुनील यादव सर दैट इज द लूप होल बेटा ओके चिन्ह में बेटा यू कैन आस्क लेट मी अनम्यूट यूर सेल्फ यस बेटा You are allowed to. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Am I audible? Very much audible, Chinnu. Hello. Yes, sir. So my question was regarding ESOP. So, mm -hmm. so uh, as we discussed that uh, the company will give give an option that uh, you can like you can buy the uh, shares of the company at a particular price, predetermined price. So, sir, can uh, an ESOP be in such a manner as well that? you know whatever the if you work here for 5 years then whatever will be the market price of the shares then uh, we will be providing you the shares at suppose a certain percentage of discount for instance 10% so can an esop be like that also okay it's not a predetermined price but a mm. predetermined like uh, discounted amount like suppose 10% discounted okay you are saying whatsoever the market price at that time you we will allot you the shares at 20% discount Is that you want to say Yes, Chin Me. For example, the market price of the shares after five years is four thousand. But company is saying at present, is a whatsoever the market price of the shares after five years, we will allot you the shares at twenty percent discount. So yes, this can be done in some cases, no problem as such. But ha, as a ho sakta hai, this can be done. Isha is saying, sir, is five year time slab fixed? No, beta. No, this is not a fixed time period. Understood. Now, please let me know who was raising the hand. Ah, uh, Sachit, I guess. Yes, yes sir, Sachit. I have a question. Can the companies issue shares at a discounted price? Because uh, from what I remember, the companies can't issue shares at discounted price. So you Better. just said that. Uh, sorry, that's the query. Uh, can Better you see. Please? ध्यान से समझ मोस्ट इंपोर्टेंट बात है यही लूप होस होता है कंपनी लोग के बेटा आप कंपनी लोग अगर रटोगे मजा नहीं आएगा एक होता है बेटा फेस वैल्यू दिस इज फेस वैल्यू ओके टेन रुपीज दिस फेस वैल्यू हैज मार्केट प्राइस ऑल्सो फॉर एग्जांपल रिलायंस का एक शेयर की जो फेस वैल्यू है टेन रुपीज है बट द मार्केट प्राइस ऑफ वन शेयर इज टू लेट से सो कंपनी कैन नॉट इशू द शेयर एट रुपीज फेस वैल्यू से नीचे तो कभी नहीं जा सकती बट यस कंपनी कैन इशू द शेयर्स एट डिस्काउंट मार्केट प्राइस से नीचे तो जा सकती है बेटा अंडरस्टेड ओके ओके गॉट इट सर दैट्स द पॉइंट गॉट ओके थैंक यू सो मच वेरी नाइस अच नहीं सर सर कैन यू प्लीज एक्सप्लेन वेस्टिंग पीरियड एक्सरसाइज पीरियड इन ईसोप्स हां जी बेटा अभी तो जस्ट मैंने एक छोटा सा कांसेप्ट समझाया है अच्छा प्रियंका ही सिंह व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन वेस्टेड राइट राइट एक्सरसाइज लेट मी टेल यू बेटा जस्ट अ सेकंड अभी तो वी हैव जस्ट स्टडीड द कांसेप्ट ऑफ ईसोप्स अभी खत्म नहीं किया बेटा मैंने ओके सो दैट्स द कांसेप्ट ऑफ ईसोप्स नाउ लेट मी टेल यू दिस फॉर एग्जांपल रिलायंस कंपनी इज सेइंग अर्चना मैडम प्लीज वर्क विद अस फॉर 6 मंथ्स जस्ट अ सेकंड प्लीज वर्क विद अस फॉर Six months, we will allot you, or you will have the option to purchase the shares. That's the important point. So, Ashna Madam, go six six months. He will work on it. After the six months, Ashna Madam will get the option to purchase the shares of Reliance. My question is very simple: whether the same is allowed, yes or no, as per your limited opinion. Yes, do let me know the answer. 
अशना मैम प्लीज बताओ प्रभाती सिंह यस सर अलाउड है ओके एवरी वन इज सेंग यस ऋषिका इज सेंग यस अशना मैडम भी कह रही है यस शेतान वेरी नाइस बेटा आदर्श अकंकृता गुरप्रीत वेरी नाइस नॉट अलाउड नॉट अलाउड सर ऐसा अलाउड नहीं है बिकॉज वी हैव टू वेट मिनिमम वन ईयर वी हैव टू वेट मिनिमम फॉर वन ईयर अर्चना मैडम इतने ज्यादा सपने मत देखो एटलीस्ट वेट फॉर वन ईयर अर्चना मैम ओके सर अंडरस्टैंड सो सर कंपनी कैन नॉट से सर वर्क विद अस फॉर सिक्स मंथ्स वी विल अलॉट यू द शेयर्स एट प्री डेटरमाइंड प्राइस इन द फ्यूचर नॉट अलाउड वी हैव टू वर्क फॉर एटलीस्ट वन ईयर दिस पीरियड इज नोन एज वेस्टिंग पीरियड this period is known as vesting period so sir you have to understand two concept one is the exercise price and one is the vesting period one is the exercise price one is the vesting period for example in this case beta the exercise price would be 2000 and the vesting period will be 5 year that's the important point everyone you should understand the same understood but as yes, vesting period should be minimum 1 year it should be minimum 1 year for everyone understood sir now the concept is clear now let me tell you the procedural aspect of esops let me tell you this now for example beta this is reliance okay now ab another example le lete hai beta priti ka madam she is also very hard working priti ka madam priti ka madam is joining the reliance industries as the compliance officer no problem sir no problem at all the share capital the authorized share capital of the reliance is let's say 10 lakh the paid up share capital of the reliance is let's say 6 lakhs no problem as such now let's say beta this is prithika this is reliance reliance industry prithika ko sapne dikha rahi hai prithika just work with us for 5 years we will allot you the shares so it means prithika will get the right to have the shares of the reliance at rupees let's say beta 1800 only and yes 5000 shares 5000 shares will be issued to miss prithika g at rupees 1800 only ab prithika sapne dekh rahi hai prithika keh rahi hai sir after 5 years the share price of the reliance will be let's say around 5 years the share price will be 10000 aur mujhe sir ek share pe sirf 2000 rupees dene pad rahe hai so sir ek share pe mujhe kitne rupees ka profit ho jayega 8000 rupees profit reliance company sapne dikha rahi hai pritika ko sapne mein dekhne mein maza aa raha hai let's say so sir let's say beta pritika agreed pritika ne agree kar liya now for an example beta understood the point please this is 20, this is 12 of september 2021 on this date ye wale din pe beta on this date company reliance industries keh rahi hai pritika ko ki work with us for 5 years we will allot you the shares after 5 years so sir kya is din whether there any requirement kya koi requirement hai जो मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ कॉर्पोरेट अफेयर्स को देना पड़ेगा वेदर वी हैव टू डू समथिंग ऑन दिस डेट द आंसर इज यस बेटा वेदर देर आर एनी रिक्वायरमेंट टू कंप्लाई विद ऑन दिस डेट द आंसर इज यस सर हर्ष इज सेइंग यस सर बट द आंसर इज नो सर इस डेट पे देर इज नो रिक्वायरमेंट एज सच नो रिक्वायरमेंट एज सच ऑन दिस डेट सर इससे पहले पहले बिफोर 
saying this reliance company must have approved reliance company ne beta ek policy approve ki hogi is policy ko kehte hai beta employee stock option scheme reliance company must have approved one scheme this scheme is known as employee stock option scheme and isko approve karwane ke liye to approve this scheme beta reliance company must have conducted the extraordinary general meeting and in this extraordinary general meeting reliance company must have passed mgt 14 बिकॉज सर ऐसा स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन पास करना पड़ता है स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन मीन बेटा सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट अप्रूवल वी हैव टू पास द स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन टू अप्रूव द स्कीम ऑफ एम्प्लॉय स्टॉक ऑप्शन एंड आज बेटा टेक अ प्लेज वेन एवर वेन एवर वी पास द स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन दैट मीन्स कंसेंट ऑफ सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट शेयर होल्डर्स we have to file mgt 14 before the ministry of corporate affairs ministry of corporate affairs ke pass we have to file this form mgt 14 understood this point sir so sir reliance company is din se pehle apna homework karke baithi hui hai reliance company must have completed its homework before this ठीक है सर इट मीन सर उसने एक स्कीम को अप्रूव करवा लिया है बाय पासिंग द स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन एंड द रिलायंस कंपनी मस्ट हैव फाइल्ड एमजीटी फोर्टीन आल्सो बिफोर द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ कॉर्पोरेट अफेयर्स तो सर इस दिन तो हमें कुछ नहीं करना बट फॉर एन एग्जांपल बेटा आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स प्रीतिका is exercising his pritika hai pritika is exercising her option so let's say beta pritika ab shares le rahi hai for example after 5 years the date would be 12 09 2000 let's say beta 2026 so after 5 years pritika is exercising her right so sir is din pe kya hame kuch karna padega yes on this date we have to file we have to file pas 3 form yes beta in this case we have to file very nice akankrita adarsh on this date beta we have to file pas 3 form in this case but yes aapko check bhi karna padega ki sir there is no requirement to increase the authorized share capital और अगर ऑथोराइज शेयर कैपिटल को इंक्रीज करने की जरूरत लग रही है आपको वी हैव टू पास और वी हैव टू फाइल वन फॉर्म आल्सो एंड द नेम ऑफ द फॉर्म इज एस एच सेवन तो सर दैट्स द ब्यूटी ऑफ दैट्स द ब्यूटी ऑफ कॉर्पोरेट लो और यू कैन से द इन हाउस काउंसिल द कंपनी सेक्रेटरी वर्क एसेट्रा एंड एसेट्रा अंडरस्टूड तो सर ऑल दीज आर द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ इसोस you are very much allowed to ask one by one by raising your hands beta uh arjuna yes beta go ahead let me yes arjuna please go ahead ha yes sir so hmm. so uh, does the scheme mention how they can exercise the option also matlab uh, uh for example suppose she is uh, given like 300 shares as esop so does the scheme uh, state that she can exercise it in like 3 years as a 100 100 shares or like at one go 300 shares so this can also be done ki sir dheere dheere aap exercise kar sakte ho for example total de diya 500 so 100 after one year 100 after two years is tarike se bhi it can be possible okay yes ashna yes okay yes gurpreet you are allowed to unmute yourself sir sir minimum vesting period is 1 year but one if year. company has given it like 2 or 3 so that will be taken yes minimum is 1 year beta but company to maximum laga hi sakti hai 
ओके इज एनी डाउट टू एनी वन इन दिस कॉन्सेप्ट बेटा we are teaching or we are understanding the most difficult concepts ye padhte padhte beta logo ke sar dard ho jata hai to understand all these concepts and whenever you join the corporate or whenever you join the top law firms beta that give you the very high pay salaries also you have to comply all these things yes dhruv you are allowed to unmute yourself uh, sir so one small doubt uh, how the share will be vested to whosoever person is it whether He or she will be able to purchase it from the market, stock market directly, or some special mechanism is there to invest the share. A special mechanism will be there, beta, because market price to beta twenty five hundred chal raha hoga at that time. Yes or no? Yes, sir. So that mechanism will also be predetermined. Correct. Okay. Sir. Okay. Harsh is saying, sir, what is the concept of passing special resolution? Beta, special resolutions means. You are taking the consent of shareholders. Is that we want to give employees a discount? We want to issue the shares to the employees at discount. For that, you should obtain the consent of the shareholders by passing the special resolution. Special resolution means consent of seventy-five percent shareholders. Okay, Hush. Any doubt to anyone now? Understood, sir. This point is clear. So, so that's the beauty of ESOPs. Also, yes, Pranka, you are allowed to unmute yourself. Sir, seventy-five uh, percent of total shareholders, or seventy-five percent of presently uh, uh, present in the meeting and uh, voting. Present in the meeting and voting, brother. Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay. So this is understood to everyone now. now let me tell you the concept of sweat equity shares very 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 important concept sweat equity shares so what is this sweat equity shares let me tell you this for an example beta this is reliance and one of the hard working student is let's say adarsh this is adarsh okay adarsh is joining the reliance industries limited as the compliance officer kash aisa din jaldi aaye reliance officer compliance officer of this reliance no problem as such ab reliance company kya keh rahi hai adarsh idhar aao you are very hard working employee very hard working employee furthermore hum aapko aaj shares de rahe hai we are allotting you the shares at present at present we are allotting you the shares so sir this is employee and reliance industries limited is allotting the shares to others at discount in present at present so sir sapne nahi dikha rahi reliance reliance company is saying to the others ki sir we will allot you the shares at present hum faltu ke sapne nahi dikhayenge sir we will allot you the shares at present <coughs> that's the concept of Sweat equity shares. So, sir, what is the difference between the ESOPs, ESOP Employee Stock Option Plan, and the sweat equity shares? Yes, anyone would like to answer this? Acha, Dhruv or Pranka, I guess. Uh, yes, Sachit, you are allowed to unmute yourself. Where is Sachit? Yes, you are allowed to unmute Sachit. What's the difference between ESOPs and this? Right, uh, the ESOPs as well as this sweat equity shares. I think in ESOPs the shares are allotted at a future date, and in sweat equity the shares are allotted then and there. Very nice, Sachit. Very nice. Akanti, I am so proud of you because you have also raised your hand. Very nice. In the case of ESOPs, beta. 
रिलायंस कंपनी आपको सपने दिखाएगी इस अलॉट टू दर्स आफ्टर फाइव ईयर्स एसेट्रा 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 वेरी नाइस रोहन बट इन द केस ऑफ स्वेट इक्विटी शेयर रिलायंस कंपनी विल अलॉट यू द शेयर एट प्रेजेंट अभी सर अभी शेयर दे देगी सर एट डिस्काउंटेड प्राइस एट डिस्काउंटेड प्राइस सो सर लेट मी टेल यू दिस सर एट प्रेजेंट योर शेयर विल बी अलॉटेड एंड देर मे बी टू केसेस या तो डिस्काउंट पे इश्यू हो बेटा या तो कंसिडरेशन अदर देन कैश इट मीन्स बेटा रिलायंस कंपनी इज नॉट टेकिंग एनीथिंग फ्रॉम यू रिलायंस कंपनी इज नॉट टेकिंग एनीथिंग फ्रॉम यू रिलायंस कंपनी आपसे आपका दिमाग ले रही है इंटेलेक्चुअल ले रही है पसीना ले रही है मेहनत ले रही है दैट द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कंसिडरेशन अदर देन कैश तो सर टू थिंग्स आर पॉसिबल टू थिंग्स आर पॉसिबल इन द केस ऑफ स्वेट इक्विटी शेयर बेटा Understood this point. So, sir, I have a question. What are the various requirements for the sweat equity shares? So, sir, we will conduct the extraordinary general meeting. Okay, in this extraordinary general meeting, beta, we will pass the special resolution. Yes, the consent of seventy-five percent shareholders. And whenever we pass the special resolution, which form? we file to the ministry of corporate affairs beta so let me know the answer in the chat box which form very nice rishika prithika arshna priyanka gurpreet arshna mgt likh rahe ho beta beta 14 bhi likh do aryaman akriti so proud of you akankrita mgt 14 we file in this case mgt 14 beta very nice rohan prabhat and after word beta after all these things we will file pass 3 also we will file pass 3 also in this case whenever we allot the shares you remember this whenever we allot the shares we file the pass 3 form in this case beta so sir in this today's class we have understood four concept the most important concept one is right issue one is esops one is bonus shares one is what what sweat equity shares batao beta if you have the doubt any question any question beta because let me tell you this this field is highly rewarding beta highly rewarding अगर आपने कॉर्पोरेट लॉ अच्छे से सीख लिया इफ यू लर्न द कॉर्पोरेट लॉ वेरी वेल रटना नहीं है रटना नहीं है सर स्काई इज द लिमिट फॉर यू यू कैन ज्वाइन द इंटर्नशिप इन द टॉप लॉ फॉर्म आप कॉर्पोरेट ज्वाइन कर सकते हो असेट्रा सेट्रा एंड देर इज नो लिमिट इफ यू लर्न द कॉर्पोरेट लॉ अच्छे से नाउ वन बाय वन यू आर अलाउड टू अनम्यूट चिन्मे यू आर अलाउड टू अनम्यूट बेटा जस्ट अ सेकेंड ये चिन्मे yes sir so i wanted to ask that uh, why in rights issue and uh, bonus issue uh, in the uh, general meeting uh, an ordinary resolution was to be passed and in uh, esop and uh, this plus weight equity uh, sp uh, special resolution is required to be passed dekho beta to issue the right issue we do not pass anything hum na to ordinary resolution pass karte hain na sr pass karte not required as such but for bonus issue we pass the ordinary resolution this is esops and this is uh, sweat equity shares dan saman ye jo sweat equity share hota hai ya jo esops hota hai that will be given to whom kisko dete hai beta isme shares shareholders ko ya employees ko beta batao to the to the employees ko employees ko very nice बट इन दस ऑफ बोनस शेयर बेटा हम किसको शेयर देते हैं शेयर होल्डर्स को अब देखो अगर शेयर होल्डर्स को ही दे रहे हो इट मीन फिफ्टी वन परसेंट से काम चल जाएगा बट अगर आप आउटसाइड शेयर होल्डर्स दे रहे हो तो बेटा गंदी बात है ना दिस इज रॉन्ग थिंग सो वी नीड द कंसेंट ऑफ 
हाई शेयर होल्डर्स हमें ज्यादा शेयर होल्डर्स की कंसेंट चाहिए यस नो बेटा यस यस इट मीन सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट वी नीड इन दिस केस डेट फॉर वी पास स्पेशल रेजोल्यूशन और ये तो बेटा आप पापा से पैसे मांग रहे हो तो इसमें हम कुछ भी पास नहीं करते अंडरस्टूड दिस यस दैट द बेसिक कॉन्सेप्ट Yeah. So uh, one, just one more thing. Uh, in uh, the sweat equity shares, one only uh, you like uh, said a point. Can you repeat it that uh, either the prices, the shares will be issued at a discount or consideration. So what is the for, consideration? For example, company is not taking anything from you. Company is saying that mm-hmm. brother, just ऐसे ही hard work करते रहो, अपना दिमाग हमें देखते रहो. That is known as Achha. दिमाग और hard work को we known as consideration other than cash. it okay. means sir something is given but that is not cash that is his hard work his dedication okay yes okay sir. thank you sir very nice chin uh dinky you are allowed to unmute uh sir i want to ask that in case of any issue of sure like right to issue we stop etc et we have to give the clause in the article that we authorize to issue the shares or we just have to conduct the egm and we can issue the shares in which case beta sir in all these four cases there is different requirements beta to issue the right issue article we don't have to check but to issue the bonus shares we have to check the article that's the different concept okay okay sir okay sir so yes any other doubt dinky no doubt sir <laughs> very nice so yes prinka you are allowed to unmute yourself beta prinka i wanted to know yeah mm. yes uh, sir i wanted to know that uh, whether the company will sign a contract uh, while issuing sweat equity shares to the employees that you cannot leave the company once we issue sweat equity shares For this much time period, whether this this will happen or they won't ask any short. Majority case, case this happens, beta. In majority okay. case, this happens. Okay. okay. You, Now let me ask you one question, everyone. This is the most important point. I request you to please stay attentive. Prithika is saying, if article of association do not provide for increasing share capital, amendment has to be carried out, and MBT fourteen is to be. फाइट वेरी नाइस प्रीतिका कितने ज्ञानी हो चुके हो बेटा आप शाबाश सो प्राउड ऑफ फॉर एन एग्जांपल बेटा दिस इज रिलायंस दिस इज प्रति दिस इज अर्चना चलो अर्चना अभी अर्चना को हम सपने दिखाते हैं अर्चना इज ज्वाइनिंग द रिलायंस कंपनी ऑन ट्वेल्थ ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी वन एज दंप्लाइंस इन हाउस काउंस चीफ मैनेजर ऑफ दिस कंपनी ओके सर एंड लेट्स से बेटा आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स लेट्स से ट्वेल्व नाइन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी सिक्स द कंपनी इज सेइंग कि सर अर्चना मैम यू हैव द राइट टू बाय द शेयर्स एट रुपीज टू थाउजेंड नो प्रॉब्लम एज सच बट लेट्स से बेटा आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स द शेयर प्राइस ऑफ दिस रिलायंस कंपनी इज गोज टू फाइव थाउजेंड पांच हजार रुपये तक चले गए whether ashna ma'am will buy the shares yes or no in this case the answer is no pritika ma'am no why pritika ma'am why no beta 5000 rupees ki cheez aapko 2000 rupees mein milti hai yes very nice everyone we will purchase ashna ma'am keh rahi yes yes sir main to purchase karungi now i have a question for everyone Whether Ashna Ma'am can sell this shares on twelve, let's say on thirteenth of September two thousand twenty-three. Whether Ashna Ma'am can do so, but whether this is allowed that after purchasing the shares simultaneously, Ashna Ma'am is selling the shares in the stock market at rupees five thousand. क्या ऐसा allowed है? Everyone is saying no. Everyone is saying no. Some are saying yes. Lydia, I was not. This was not expected, beta. Lydia, this was not expected. One year period has to pass. Achna, kahan likha hai one year has to pass? 
where it is written that one year has to be passed. Everyone is committing some mistakes now, but the answer is, the answer is, yes, but Ashna, let me try to unmute you. Just a second, where are you? Ashna, yes, Ashna. Where it is written, beta, that one year should be passed, you are allowed to unmute yourself now. Kar sakte ho aap apne aap ko. Hanji. No, no, by mistake. no, no, you can sell the shares, I think. The answer is allowed, sir. <laughs> Are, paan saal, yes, yes. <laughs> paan saal tadpi hai, Archana. Sir, de do shares, de do shares. Abhi or kitna tadpa ho hai. <laughs> so, sir, this is allowed. This is allowed. But let me tell you the another concept. Let's say this is Ashna. This is Reliance. And this is 12th of September 2021. Okay. Now, beta, Ashna is joining this Reliance company on 12th of September 2021. And at present, Reliance company is allotting the shares to us at present. That is known as sweat equity shares. And let's say beta at discount. It means at present, the market price of the shares is 1400. Ashna is giving rupees 200 only. Whether on 13th of September 2021, Ashna ma'am can sell the shares. Yes or no? Adarsh, okay, very nice, beta. Yes, do let me know the answer in the chat box. Everyone is saying now, no. But the answer is, the answer is, <laughs> Chinma is saying yes. Harsh is saying yes, but the answer is no. Are sir, whether Ashna ma'am has taken a, you can say, pratikriya. Kya Ashna ma'am ne abhi intazar kiya hai? Whether Ashna ma'am has waited something? The answer is no. Ashna ma'am ne koi bhi abhi intajari nahi kiya. Now, Ashna ma'am has not sacrificed anything as of now. So sir, aisi kar dege kya? In this case, Ashna ma'am has worked for five years. That is why she can sell this shares. But for an example, here in this case, Ashna ma'am has not waited for any period. Unko to bas shares moft mein diye ja rahe hai. So in this case, selling is not allowed for minimum three years. Ashna Madam cannot sell this shares for minimum three years. So the hard work due to which at first place the shares were locked. Let us see. Due to this hard work, we are allotting the shares at discount. But itna hard work ko misuse mat karo, beta. Abhi wait to karo thoda sa. In the case of sweat, uh, ESOPs, Ashna ma'am has waited for some period. That's why it is allowed. But in the case of sweat equity shares, Ashna ma'am ne intazar nahi kya. That is why it is not allowed. Understood. But if you have the doubt, you are again very much allowed to ask one by one by raising your hand because this meeting is very restrictive in nature. So you are very much allowed to raise your hand. Yes, Dhruv, you are allowed to unmute. Uh, uh, sorry, Dhruv, yes, you are allowed to unmute, Bita. Uh, sir, like you said, that uh, sweat equity shares cannot be sold for minimum period of three years. Yes. So, uh, what if the uh, employees terminated or leave the company within that period, the shares are still vested on that employee or what happens in that circumstance? Yes, the same will be vested. The same will be vested and the locking period will be three years. Yes, it will be three years. Oh, yes. Because you shares you. Gaya hai na, beta. you got the shares. Yes, sir. Also, sir, uh, one small doubt. So, huh. will the T plus, two, T plus two day concept will be followed or not in such circumstances? Like on 12th September, the shares are allotted, but it will take minimum two days to be shown in DMAT account. So, Correct. will that concept be followed? Nowadays, beta, there is a concept of T plus one. Coffee stock exchange are now adopting the concept of T plus one also. You know the concept? Yes, sir. 
you must have read this in the news that various stock exchanges is now planning to adopt this t plus 1 ye to beta maine just ek example ke liye diya ki she is getting the shares today and now she is selling that is just for the example but yes do din to wait karna hi padega na correct okay yes thank you sir okay let me check this no doubt at all archna any doubt let me yes ask yes archna so uh, like you said in esop uh, once the shares are allotted they might have a contract with the employee that they are not supposed to leave the company mm -hmm. so even in case of threat equity uh, since there is already a 3 years lock in period on transfer mm -hmm. uh, will there be restriction like on the employee that he cannot uh, leave the company for this this period after allotment of sweat equity but for example beta if company is terminating the employee is there any default of the employees in that case batao to so normally pata hai kya karti hai company main aapko samjhata hu whenever company issue the sweat equity shares company na ek condition lagati hai normally that is being followed practically Company says whenever we terminate you, whenever we terminate you, this shares will be forfeited. The first thing. The second thing, company क्या condition लगाती है? If you resign, if you resign for let's say three years, this shares will again be forfeited. That's the company imposed the conditions practically. ये कानून में नहीं लिखा, but that is practical. Got the point, Ashna? Okay. Pritika is saying, sir, what is GMAT? Acha. Muskan is saying, sir, what is GMAT? What is T plus one? Shaitan bachi. Pritika is sir, sir, can you explain sales with regard to the ESOPs? Pritika, can you understand, beta? Muskan, I am just coming to you also. For an example, beta, this is Reliance. This is Ashna. Ashna is joining the Reliance on twelfth of September. Now we. अर्चना को सपने दिखा रहे हैं कि सर इफ यू वर्क विद अस फॉर फाइव इयर्स हम आपको शेयर्स दे देंगे सो लेट्स से अर्चना विल गेट द शेयर्स ऑन ट्वेल्थ ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी सिक्स एंड लेट्स से बेटा अर्चना इज एक्सरसाइजिंग हर राइट सो सर इमिडिएटली आफ्टर फाइव इयर्स लेट्स से ऑन थर्टीन अर्चना ये शेयर्स को सेल कर सकती है अर्चना हैज द राइट टू सेल दिस शेयर्स इन द मार्केट एट रुपीज फाइव थाउजेंड अर्चना ने लिए दो हजार रुपए के बट शी कैन सेल द शेयर एट रुपीज फाइव थाउजेंड इन दिस स्टॉक मार्केट शेयर मार्केट में ऐसा कर सकती है बेटा दैट इज द कॉन्सेप्ट सर प्लीज रिपीट दैट रेजिग्नेशन वाला कॉन्सेप्ट अगेन रेजिग्नेशन लेट इट बी बेटा दैट इज नॉट इंपॉर्टेंट एज ऑफ नाउ सर कैन स्वेट इक्विटी शेयर बी अलॉटेड ड्यूरिंग इनकॉर्पोरेशन ऑफ कंपनी Even in the form of preferences. अरे बेटा नाम के आगे ही sweat equity share equity shares लिखा है तो आप sweat preferences कैसे कर सकते हो शैतान बच्ची और बच्चा है ये तो ये तो मुहिब है very nice मुहिब so at the time of incorporation बेटा we can issue the sweat equity shares no problem at all but that will be in the form of equity shares okay understood sir. So, बेटा दैट्स द ब्यूटी ऑफ द कॉर्पोरेट लॉ ये ब्यूटी होती है कॉर्पोरेट लॉ की एज ऑफ नाउ वी हैव जस्ट स्टडीड द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ राइट इश्यू बोनस शेयर्स स्वेट इक्विटी शेयर्स एंड द इम्प्लॉय स्टॉक ऑप्शन प्लान सी इफ यू लर्न द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द कॉर्पोरेट लॉ अच्छे से अच्छे से मीन्स प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपेक्ट ऐसी कोई आज तक बुक बनी नहीं है बेटा जो आपको प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपेक्ट दे दे फर्दर मो ऐसा कोई शायद कोर्स भी नहीं है जो आपको प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपेक्ट दे दे बट आई एम जस्ट ट्राइंग वट्स आई हैव द एक्सपीरियंस आई एम जस्ट लैक्टिंग टू यू सो डेट यू विल लर्न द प्रैक्टिकल एक्सपीरियंस इन द इजी मैन इफ यू स्टिल हैव द डाउट बेटा इन द बोनस शेयर राइट इशू एसेट्रा 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 यू मे आस्क आई एम जस्ट गिविंग एन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू अनम्यूट एवरी वन कैसे देंगे ये लेट मी चेक दिस जस्ट सेकेंड Yes, you may raise. You may still may raise your hand if you want to ask some question. Otherwise, we will wind up this session. No doubt, sir. I okay, no doubt. But before winding up this session, beta, let me give you one situation. Let me give you or let me tell you a good news for everyone. Those who have 
those who have joined the contract drafting batch one that's not the good news for you beta ye to aapko milega hi milega that's a gesture from my side those who are the student of contract drafting first batch but those who are new students those who are new students beta this is most important for you just a second yes those who are the contract drafting first batch students whosoever will score the top marks i will provide this to every person those who will score the top marks but yes sir this is a course in front of you the course on the company law as well as the sebi most important concepts sir this is the introduction this is the private funding private funding kaise hoti hai prospectus private venture private equity general meetings loans etc 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 corporate social responsibility that is most important merger and acquisition merger amalgamation with sebi insider trading prohibition etc 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 so this beautiful course has been designed for the new students contract drafting jo first wale hai beta uske liye to i will provide free of course no need to worry about the same but those who are new students for those this is a course in this course beta everything will be taught to you in the practical manner thank you sir rahel okay beta but for those who are scoring the highest marks as of now archna you are the one you will get this lectures without any course beta let me see the name of another student also uh sudanshu you will also get this and harucha you will also get this and ek aur bachchi hai rupshika wonderful so proud of the rupshika usne itna acha likha tha beta test very very nice bahut acha test likha tha rupshika was the first candidate jisne bahut acha test likha hai so sir this course is in front of you wherein we will teach you the pro prohibition of insider trading delisting most important one thing is corporate social responsibility general meetings merger and acquisition yes merger and acquisition is the most important concept this is again you will get so as of now there is no course in this case as a koi bhi course nahi you will learn the dividend also you will learn the general meeting also section 186 etc etc and etc so this is a complete package beta i will ask my team sir to share this with everyone i will ask my team to share this with everyone again ye to meri guarantee hai beta 100% payback <laughs> yahi apni usp bhi hai beta because we believe in ourselves and sir as a old koi course hai nahi there is no course as such but jo bhi course hai jo bhi course hai beta you will get this for rupees 30000 40000 50000 etc 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 but here this is again you will get this for rupees itna for two itna itna and itna so there is no need to worry about the same for contract drafting first batch students those who are the top scorers beta top scorers this will be my love towards them ye mera pyar hoga beta unke liye taki aap tarakki karo and mujhe bahut acha lagega so that will be my love toward the top scorers of this contract drafting first batch so this course will start from 5th of october 5th of october this course will start with and yes classes to beta saturday and sunday hi hogi classes will be on saturday and sunday only for one hour all right thank you really grateful So that's the basic concept, beta. If you still have doubt, you are very much allowed to ask me, and you can also reach me. Prabhat, Prabhat, beta, ध्यान से समझो. Again, मैं आपको बताता हूँ for those contract drafting first batch वाले students, we will conduct the test again. We will conduct the test again, beta, and I will let you know the date. उसमें अगेन जो टॉप परफॉर्मर्स होंगे बेटा दे विल गेट ओके प्रभात यू कमिटेड सम मिस्टेक आई एम सो सॉरी बेटा बट यस आई एम आई वांट टू सी यू टू रीच द स्काई 
So, can you please explain the difference between private placement and the right issue? Harshita, no need to worry about the same, but a private placement is the different thing. Private placement is the different thing, better. And one more thing, this is again supported by my Honorable Institute Bar Council. One only course. Thank you so much to everyone. This will be shared with you. If you still have the doubt, you can ask me anytime. But for those who are the first contract drafting students and who are the top performers, this will be my love towards you. I am with you, everyone. So can you share the new course in the group? Yes, but I will share the same. I will ask my team to share with you by today itself. Okay. Thank you so much to everyone. Muskani say, sir, uh, am I the first batch of... Yes, beta. Muskan, you are in the first batch, I guess. You are, you are in the first batch, I guess. Okay. Thank you so much, everyone. Take care. Stay safe. Keep learning. Keep moving. Keep growing. Thank you.